This is a place to avoid. The crater here will drive you mad, and only death will bring peace. So you can't actually get the Madstone Rage, which is a real problem as a spellcaster it prevents you from <laughs> casting spells. And the only thing that dispels the Madstone Rage is a, a Madstone Horn, so really you're just bleeding it out most of the time. It's On a there. bluff high above the giant chieftain, a red crystal radiates malign magical power. Blaze looks down at you expectantly. Well, here we are, Saluka. I'm glad you've come. What a mess. This is the source of the magic, all right. All the giants who ventured in have gone horribly mad, except my seers, that is. They found some way to show themselves and forged ahead. Only now, time's gone by and they haven't returned. It's uh, big rivers across the I'm going after them and help them stop the magic. That's right. According to the seers, there's three crystals that magnify the spell, but the source is somewhere else. Top the central spire, perhaps. Anything you should know? Yes. Damn crystals affect the storm's heart clans as well. Unfortunately, I brought a host of them along with me for help. Now the place is crawling with crazed ogres and mad minotaurs. You better find those three crystals and smash them quick. Here we go then. Blaze calls out after you. Find the seers. Help them stop this madness before we tear ourselves apart. Wait, seriously, all this stuff so you're a giant going on, dude. So let's get those guys up, and now we're going to run over here and clean these guys up. We can take our lives, but not our hearts. I'm, I'm pretty sure we can do both. Right. Anyway, good luck with that. In the passage beneath the crater, intense heat wells up from the floor. signs of a spellcaster or the giant seers ahead. Only piles of gargantuan bones. The gateway slides open, and beyond, a, a living dicey. giant bellows in rage. This guy... Because my weapons are being splash damaged now. These guardians are some new magic, says the seer. They protect the south crystal. Come quickly. He left me up. Just as an experiment. I am into the chaos damage. I thought as much, but yeah. all this trash is killing me.
Half seen from the crater floor lies ahead. A shimmering magic crystal. <laughs> The seer stands before the southern crystal, waiting. Come, says the seer. Defend me. I must shatter this evil thing. It's fish shattered. The seer turns to you. Why you stop And I didn't really like to perp her. Where the hell did she go? Are you kidding me? That's another big like why is she up there? She's runs to the top of the hill for no particular reason. I like to park her here because when these guys come out, it does cause a small bit of aggro lock. So they can't decide whether they want to run up there and kill him or run to kill her. One of the times where the uh, the broken Threat charts for the mobs kind of works in your advantage. You also used to be able to do that with flaming spheres. Well, you could cast a couple of flaming spheres and they would just lose their minds chasing flaming spheres around, which generate a massive amount of The sphere calls out, keep them at bay. Even though the flaming sphere does effectively no damage. I've, I don't know that I've ever taken damage from a flaming sphere. DC, the safety DC is incredibly low. Gotta love look at that cloak, though. It makes me inordinately happy to have that. Probably because I managed to finish the completionist, like, literally the day before that was Because so, I thought, oh, they're probably going to do something that's, you know, going to be a demarcation for having finished the old system, so. Even if it is just a cloak. Because, um, and a lot of people were, I mean, understandably, if not justifiably, upset because, you know, you, a lot of people, including myself, put a lot of time into that Destiny system. It was, it was strategy, it was planning, it was, you know, multiple play styles, it was understanding. Almost modes. done, the seer screams. Not much longer. You know, just to, just to get it to happen. Um, that being said, it was pretty busted simply because any system where my paladin should run in the bard fate singer simply because it is the best possible option for dps that's that's messed up like that obviously needed to change where there was clear choices for a few things and very suboptimal choices for literally everything else so yeah the the fact that they changed it, I am not sorry to see the old system go. It needed to be reworked. And the fact that a few people had a few builds worked out that managed to exploit the loopholes or synergies in the old system is not a justification for keeping something old and busted around, you know? There are, there are people who just are terrified of change. The seer pants heavily. I feel the magic source. It is near, I am sure. And as I have stated many times in the past, I am I am not a fan of pay gates. I think that's ridiculous. I think Path of Exile was one of the better examples of the dust and debris under how you can have a massive amount of has gone pain. undisturbed for a very long time. Massive enough player game that's effectively non monetized and make and make it successful. Because I think, like, you literally can't buy anything except cosmetics in Path of Exile. So, that is something I can do. And it works. It absolutely works. The gate opens, and a maddened giant seer comes charging out. <laughs> Madness overcame me, says the seer. Better now. Time to find the crystal. This is a curiosity. 
curiosity, did I yank? I did yank him out. So I'm a shield guardian as well. So anyway, it should be fun. Well, a bright cascade of lava plummets from a high. Get level 20. See the opponent. Have the dogs breakfast. I'm gonna make it a great time to grab the big destinies. The only mistake is that um, between the destinies and the nerf to the mob stats, which is also something that desperately needed to happen. It makes the leveling process a lot faster and smoother. Four natural ramps rise up to the central crystal. This will be a difficult position to defend. And that's a trick. You run past the uh, skeletons. And they block the ramps. Crystal must be destroyed, says the seer. Ready when you are. The seer turns to you. I do the ritual. You keep me safe. And then we just kind of peep down the, the ramps to see who's coming. Just a slow waiting process while we wait to see who's showing up. Looks like they're uh, hung up there. Might be fine with that. Assuming they don't all break through at once. The seer calls out. Keep them at bay. About this clown. The seer screams. Not much longer. This has been wildly successful, actually. Normally, it doesn't work this well. Usually, a couple guys sneak up the back ramps. But this has worked swimmingly. This guy. Caster of the spell. He. it is not what we think. But first, the crystal. It didn't work out the way you hoped, did it, buddy? Okay, so. Good to fit.
trash lying around and cause all kinds of weird mechanics. It's like back in the old days, uh, the people running the you know, twilight all the time. The spider quest, which the name of which escapes me. And in the spider quest, we had to defend the spider queen. You, you know, you could actually finish the objective and kill the boss and lose because you forgot one of the archers up top who would just keep shooting the queen for like three points of damage at a time and she'd die because she's not defending herself anymore and you're like what the hell just happened you just failed you another crazed storm's heart falls. that's because you left the trash there are surely behind. more but at least their number the tunnel rises ahead winding up the crater's edge <laughs> So we'll just switch to our bone breaker over here. From beyond the open gate comes a dull sound of footsteps, dry as rapid waves. Because Madstone Rage increases strength and constitution and AC, but it prevents spell casting. There are actually boots, um, which I do have, um, called the Madstone boots that would proc that My effect every time you got hit. Bones grumbles the seer, made to fight against me. Time we ended this outrage. And uh, they were a very good time. They were like a, almost a crucial part of any barbarian build for some time back in the day but then um once this the whole speed thing came in and you needed to arrows shower down from the entrance to the crater's northern slope they were juggling uh, set bonuses of deadly and melee alacrity and all that stuff they became less attractive because you're losing too much because usually your speed item is your, your boots and they do provide striding those boots do provide striding but they do not melee speed. You are actually getting melee speed from a different weapon that actually comes from Giant, giant Hole called Jorgendal's Collar, which was, and some people still think is, um, the best in, in slot item that was a neck item that was both run speed and melee alacrity and it had a slot on it. So it was, it was a pretty must have for a long time and I know I found that quite a bit and they cost you because they were unbound so you could uh, occasionally find them on the auction house for a fortune but um, but yeah even that uh, in favor but it is if you're a new player it is actually worth getting if you want to run through giant hole across the bridge and up the cliff lies the north crystal and, could do that, but honestly, at the level, you might as well just start finding out Sean. Most people have everything they've got a Sean. So, so there's not much point. But, uh, so now, normally, what I like to do is I actually bring both my Shield Guardian and my Scarecrow. Them parked here. I'm not sure where his. Okay, okay so where's the scarecrow? Where is it? 
<laughs> all right, all right. Oh, there it is. Way up there, derp. Okay. Totally lost it on the on the haft of the axe. It's crazy. That's what happens when I'm doing it in the super high res and I can't see the tiny tool bars. Which again is, I believe, is totally for your benefit. If you don't like it, that's fine. Um, let me know. But again, it gives you more screen instead of like kind of focusing on these tool bars. And I am using the uh, the Blackbird. Blur. I like to call this my blur factory. And you can go in the end things. There we go. Funsies. The seer awaits your order. Nervous the seer turns to you. Oops. The ritual begins. I swear it's not on purpose. It's my ADD, that's my story, and I'm sticking to it. Standard practice used to be back in the day that you would have somebody parked at the gate below with trash coming from the load up there. So infrequent that um, you're better off to just kind of leave it go. You know I can still see you, right? Can't we see me here, bud? The seer looks very weak. The magic comes from the spire. Go now. Stop this madness. Thank you, gentlemen. You have done brave service. What? I, okay. Can, like, maybe he just can't even because he's been told to stop. Or oh, he's got the mad stone rage. I bet. Yeah, he's got the mad stone rage. That's what the problem is. Okay. So that's the the issue. Um, so you guys will just you guys can just chill. So because I don't have the ability to trap. We have a locked door, and so we need to get to that locked door. And of course.
question becomes, how do you get to the lock door? Well, if you look below, oops, and I've fallen down, there is the skeleton body over here. And so we grab that iron key. And run through him. Through a nominal less dangerous. Molten ability. lava forms a deadly pool in the crater's trough. And that will allow us to get in. An ancient gate is soundly locked. It shows no signs of having been opened in a very long time. So we'll go ahead and pop on the death words. Ancient enchanters rise from their slumber, ill pleased at a stranger's intrusion. magic to defend it. It will go easier now that they are gone. Okay. And again, uh, this is when we want to take a dimension door and get the heck out of here, but we don't got that option, so we are just going to Sprint our way out of here. Sprint sprint boost is fun for the whole family and everyone watching. Okay. Just in time, says Blaze. Look, the gate to the spire's gone down, and a horde of maddened monsters is coming through it. Huh. I don't know that I've ever actually watched that happen before. Crater's large central spire lies beyond a gate of bone. Does the caster of the madness man a narrow ramp winds up to the top of the spire? At its peak, the true caster of the madstone spell awaits. A skeletal warlock. This must be the source of the madstone spell. <laughs> here in the first place perhaps blaze and his seers have answers okay so that went about as well as it possibly could i think Ooh, it's not hitting the magic spell First, there was still a guy that we didn't. That's amazing. Alright, he's not a bug. 
I'm actually using the these are the uh, Razor Claw boots. But they are free falling. So. Good, good, the giant roars. My seer savy skeletons were dragon magic. Our ancestors' bones used to hide their dirty tricks. A curse upon you their. You want to see heads. the claws? Alright, hold on. I don't know if I've got the. the uh, 